Alright, so this is uh, Saturday. It's 9 o'clock here, so 10, 11, 12 o'clock over there. In Ontario, uh, Ontario, Ottawa, Canada. So this is what it looks like. Minus 30 degrees. So this is what freedom is about. Man, what a difference between those people in Canada, Ottawa, Canada. Minus 20 degrees to here, 90 degrees. What a beautiful day to go skateboarding. We are here. Sunday. Place is closed. We're outside. Hey, hey, what's up, YouTube? Oh, very nice, man. Today's Super Bowl Sunday. But you know what? Fuck that shit. Right here is the Super Bowl, right here, man. Fucking freedom. Skateboarding. It's all we need. Ah, oh, very beautiful. It was 90 earlier, but it's like 88 degrees right now, man. Today is February 13th, 2022. Deuce, deuce, on a Sunday. Like I said, Super Bowl Sunday, but super, I'll call it Super Skateboarding Sunday, you know? Fuck that. You know, the jocks are starting to beat me up in the 80s when I started skateboarding, you know? Fuck them. Fuck them fucking jocks. Yeah, man, back then, you know? Cause what happened was like all the cool chicks, you know, the good, the cool chicks, not the, not the cheerleaders and all the wannabe fucking bitches like that, but the cool chicks, you know, back then it was cool, they had like different color hair, that was before all that fucking gender swap shit, but, you know, like fucking like punk rock, you know, like goth, eyeshadow and all that shit, smoking, you know, of course they all smoke, you know how it is, it's cool to smoke, so. Yeah, we had all those cool chicks back then, man. And then they were jealous, man. Because they didn't want to be fucking having to do it with the jocks. So they're like, fuck the skateboarder, pot smoking, drug addict shit. So yeah, they would chase us all everywhere. But hey, guess what? Skateboarding is the most popular fucking sports. By, by far now, man. You know? It's number one sports. Can we say? Just like the fucking truck, the truck convoy, man. They're gonna hold the line, just like I held the line for skateboarding. You know, I held the line, man. No matter what happened, I stuck with skateboarding. Yeah, man. These truckers gonna hold the line, and it's gonna go in history, man. It changed the world. We get our freedom back. That's what it's all about. Anyway, man, it's around, uh, you know, almost two o'clock. Oh, uh, beautiful. Yeah, man. What can I say, man? Just last, last night, just watching that video from the beginning here. It's awesome. 20, 25 degrees below zero and shit. 20, whatever. It's fuck. They didn't care, man. So if you see, they were like partying, right? I remember in the early, early 2000, man. Chad Muska, you know, that was like the name back in the day even Tony Hawk no one even care about it's all about the Muska you know and he was doing a lot of rave rave uh, videos you know like not rave, rave parties out there in the desert about in San Bernardino Riverside area had a bunch I remember one of them me and Jason Martinez went into uh, we drove out there and you know they put our name and shit we got in it took a while but we got in and they had a little, uh, just like the convoy, they have like a tent, you know, set up for skateboarders. They had stacks and stacks in case of water, Gatorade, whatever, you know. Back then, it wasn't like right now, man, where everybody in their fucking mom got a monster, especially Niger. A monster hat, a Red Bull hat, a fucking rock star hat, some kind of energy shit, right? Fuck that, man. Back then, 
We didn't give a fuck. Just give us water. That's all we need. You know? Once in a while, they have like Gatorade, shit like that. Nah, nowadays, everywhere, man. Energy drink. That shit's no good for you, man. It's all about the regular foot crazy water, man. Give me some crazy water, regular foot. <laughs> nah, no, no. Because, you know, regular foot, man, he'll fucking send that shit to me in the mail. It's fucking crazy like that. Nah, man, I got the... I got the... I got plenty of nice water. The Walgreens water, nice one. It's cool, man. These are only like $2.99. Can't believe it. $2.99. So, low, where the fuck you going with this story? Thank you, Plastic Pimp. You love what uh, look, me with the story, so I'm gonna keep going. Plastic Pimp. And, uh, am I gonna go with this? Okay. So, they had a. Uh, Street cars, you know, skateboard street cars, and uh, then on the other side is rave, you know. You see those people in the beginning of the video? That's genuine, true love, man. You know, no drugs. I mean, they had a beer or whatever, probably smoked some marijuana or whatever, but not not like, you know, not like the parties here, man. You know. So you can see the energy there, and. That rave that Chad Muska had, it's mostly high school, you know, young kids, you know, that goes to those shit. But there's a lot, 10,000 or so. And uh, a lot of them doing like, you know, ecstasy, or what is it called, mol, mol, molin, molus, something, some shit about, with the ecstasy ingredients in it. You know, they're doing a lot of that shit. And uh, what happened is they don't understand that I mean, I never done it either, but your body gets hot just by observing the people, right? So we're there, and it was at nighttime, and I was walking around like this with the water like this, and all kinds of all kinds of kids they would come up and be like, "Hey, man, I'll give you three dollars for that bottle of water." I was like, "What?" It's like, "Nah, man, you can have it. You got plenty of them at the fucking musket tent over there." Cause I didn't know, you know? I don't do drugs, I don't know, didn't know what, what was going on. But, what happened was the vendors, they were sold out of water, man. No more water, only water was on the skateboarding side. And you hear all these ambulances coming in, going out, coming in. And I'm like, hey man, hey, what's going on? Ask somebody, it's like, oh, it's somebody so-and-so OD and shit, you know? Or OD, but like OD from heat stroke. The body got so hot. Oh shit, I think my flagpole is here. I see the Amazon. Let me see if it stops. There's the Amazon. There's the Amazon. I ordered a flagpole yesterday. Let's see if it stops. Ah. Uh, they say it's supposed to be next day, next day uh, delivery. The flagpole. But yeah, man, I walk around. All kinds of be like, hey man, you got water? You got water? I'm like, nah, I'll get you some though. So you go back to the tent, I put a bunch of them in my pocket, you know? Yeah. We just went there, riding a skateboard, see these, everyone just boom, 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 boom. And then the body just fucking overheated and they dropped fucking dead, man. So what I'm trying to say is, I would 100% go to the, in a fucking Freedom Convoy party than any of these fucking parties out here. California, Florida, New York, whatever, you know? Here they're using like famous people's names and shit to get people to go. Yeah, so that's what happened, man. Fucking people just dropped dead in the water. I was like, nah, man, have it. Fuck, I want your money, you know? So yeah, I was always like that, man. I'm always hype, happy, and everything. And even on my dialysis, after dialysis, I'm like, yeah, man, let's go, you know. And some of the patients even saying, hey, man, what the nurse give you? Because when when I'm done, when I'm done with my treatment, I'm fucking out. I'm passed out, you know. I mean, I got no energy. All I want to do is, uh, all I want to do is go home and go to sleep. And I asked him, hey, do you uh, exercise? No. 
Do you stretch? No. Do you uh, cook your own food? No. That's why. <laughs> That's the secret. And uh, yeah, man. Regular food, crazy water. That's all the story for today. You're probably like, oh shit, about time. <laughs> I think if it's possible to do kick turn right here. I got I got enough room. Plenty of room. Backside kick turn. Guess that could be trick of the day. You know, Sunday. Not really too much happening, so I don't wanna no point to like go your all out you know that's what happens when you go all out sometimes you go way way all out and your your body's sore for like two three days I don't need that so yeah yeah trick of the day uh trick of the day backside kick turn on the freedom bank yeah that's it Trick of the day, man. Manual right here. That's some day one song shit. I got the 50 millimeter wheels, just need the day one song tricks, and we're good. Garbage over there, I gotta grab something. Let's go check it out. Someone ran it over. I heard the. <laughs> oh, we forgot one piece. Got one piece. It's okay. Let's kick it over to the corner. I'll pick that up next time. Yeah, the thing, the thing with that kick turn on those ramps, quarter pipe is so skinny. You have to, you got to kick 180. So, since my manual sucks, you know, you gotta be good with manuals to do it. You gotta go straight up, straight down. So I want to practice on the, the quarter pipe first. So you're gonna practice the kick turn the quarter pipe. Then we'll tackle the freedom, freedom bank, freedom convoy, freedom truck convoy 20, 
222 bank. Another trash bag. Another liquor bag. You know what's good with these? I wore a bunch of uh I ordered four more sets of these uh 50 millimeter wheels. $16 per set. Came out to be like $65 or something. So you put the these wheels in a black bag. Okay? That's how they stay white. That's why a lot of the white, a lot of white. That's why when you go to the skateboard shop and buy wheels, the wheels are like yellow. You know, they turn yellow from the the fluorescent light. That's why. Um, that's why they don't have no lights on those uh, display cases. Because those fluorescent lights will fade. That's why you see like half the wheel is like faded yellow. You know, like half is yellow from the sitting in the shelf for so long, and uh, they turn yellow. So the thing is, you have to put them in these black bags and put them in a dark, dark place. That's why Spitfire sells so good, because they're always keeping the underground lit, you know? You know what I mean? Alright, more kick turns, and then we'll tackle this kick turn. could I could move the ramp over so we have more room but then we, we would invade the the pedestrian part you know oh, we don't want to do that we don't want people to get mad at you know what I mean it's just like the convoy protests keep it peaceful still get our things done you know but we'll still keep it peaceful you know peaceful would be Peaceful we be. <laughs> I know, right? You gotta do at least ten. Ah, shit. Getting better. Better than Isra. Was that tree? Tree is a magic number. Yes, it is. It's a magic number. A man and a woman had a child. They had three in a family.
got to do it the hard way. No kick turn, baby. You got five? Oh, I almost tripped on the freedom ring. Size man, everything's so so skinny. Yeah. Eight, two more, baby. Bye bye. When I think about you, I think about love, darling. I can't live without you. And love. Time to do this kick turn. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Time to do the kick turn. Da -da -da. All right. Kick turn right here. <clears throat> Gotta go over here. Look good. All right, let's do this. Not a kick turn. Yeah, I know. Ah, I don't know why, man. 
Backside kick turns are so scary, I don't know. Crazy. Which caveman here? It's pretty scary for a switch caveman. Because you think you gotta slide down, you know? Thing is, I won't try to do so many things. Stick with the script. No, no scripting. No scripting. have my helmet hit my head on you. Ugh. Yeah. That's what I was afraid I was gonna shoot out. See how weak my ollies are, right? You barely ollie up that.
hot water. <laughs> Grinding. I mean, it's not big, but it's a good start to like learn backside ollies, you know? Pretty cool. You never know, you know, when you go out and buy your skateboard, you never know what trick comes. And most tricks don't come, come to you. <laughs> Take it though. So I guess I'll uh, I guess I'll change the trick of the day to backside backside ollie on the freedom bank. Yeah. I mean, we already did the kick turn on the quarter pipe. You know. So how am I gonna improve my vertical leap if I don't practice my ollies? So we'll just do that. And see if I can see how high. I could even get to like right. If I get to right here, I'm good. If all my four, okay. The goal is to get all four wheels on the Freedom Bank, okay? That's the goal. So that's the trick of the day. Backside Ollie. All four wheels on the Freedom Bank. All right, backside, make sure. All four wheels has to be on the Freedom Bank. It doesn't count, okay? Watch out for the manis. Manny, man. Front door. Got two on.
does it. That was cheating where I got the front two wheels on and I went like that. It's cheating. What the? I was set up so hard I, I grinded the curb. I got scared because I grinded the curb earlier. The trick looks so easy, huh? Till you go out and try it. Okay, you see, the way the trick, the way I'm doing the trick is, I'm ollieing, while I'm in the air, I'm shifting back like that. See, ollie and shift. It's almost like I laid Ollie backside. Just shift to the side. Shift behind you, you know? Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna do it anymore. Well, something came up. So. It's always next time, you know? No, my wife's sister, or my sister-in-law, she called and said my wife called her and then she tried to call her back and just went to uh, voicemail, so I don't know, I gotta go see what's going on. Oh well, it's just the skateboard trick, you know, sometimes you get it, sometimes you don't. Like I said, the trick has to come to you, you know, don't force it. It will. Thanks for watching, man. See you guys next time, enjoy, alright? Keep on rolling. You wanna see me have fun, you see me quit. Running water and go stale. Enjoy.